Hey guys, it is the day after Christmas and I am very excited. Um, a few weeks ago I lost my cooler that holds ice. The compressor blew up and they said it's going to cost me about $300 to replace it. So that just kind of bummed me out but at the same time made me excited. So I think I'm going to turn this in to a little aquaponics station. Put up fish, put a medium bed up on top, and a raft system on the side. So all I have to do is start taking all this apart and see where we go. Okay, so we're going to have this space, I would assume, oh, about 100 gallons worth. And all I have to do is take out the fan in here, drill some holes at the top, maybe drill a hole on the side. I don't know. We're just going to get started and start tearing stuff apart. So it's all taken out. There's already a hole in the bottom, uh, in the back, to run our piping and any kind of electrical. And all I have to do is drill one more hole over here, put a liner, good to start. Okay, so I have this old pool that, you know, just 15 foot, it was just getting old, I wasn't using it. So we were going to use it for the liner, for the fish tank and for the grow bed. I got it all cut up in pieces. and. Well, now that we've uh, gutted out the cooler, uh, took the top off and took out the fan inside, now it's time to start building the bed for the top. So, we'll, I think it's going to be about two foot by a little bit over four foot, and uh, we're going to use part of that swimming pool liner. Okay, so I have some scrap lumber, some, uh, some two by sixes, a little sheet of plywood, and uh, we're going to start cutting this together and see if we can get it all done and put the liner in it. Okay, now we got the frame built. We'll turn this over, put the plywood on top, and uh, that'll be the bottom. And we got to drill a hole for the drain. So I had a hard time figuring out how to get the drain through. 
So I'm going to use this little fitting here. It's uh, something for a pex, but we don't use this cap. Not that you can really see it. Um, we came up with this for the top and this for the bottom. It's the same thing except I had to cut off the excess to go inside the cooler. So it'll look like this. So we'll Okay, so we have the uh, top bed is in place, uh, no leaks, very excited about that. Um, the pool liner worked out real good, uh, it was kind of hard around the edges, they were pretty tight. So we stuck uh, the one by twos around the whole perimeter there. So I think it's going to work. So we've got to start putting in the, uh, the drains, we'll have to go all the way over to there. There will be hole drilled out through that side for the external bed, but we'll also have it where it drops down. So we shall see, but it's in place. Okay, so the next steps are done. Uh, here's a little progress. Uh, we got the grow bed up on top. We have the auto siphon sitting in place. I think it's going to work. We may have to adjust it. Um, we have the pipe coming out and up flowing inside it. We just used three quarters because that's what I had. And then. All the plumbing so far is done. Um, we have the pump three quarters up and come over. Uh, we have to adjust the water flow up at top and then I have a little hole here at the bottom to uh, help aerate, I guess you want to call it. And then as it goes up, it comes back through. And for now, we're going to just run it down to cause the siphon to flow. But we have this pipe goes out, so it's going to have an external uh, raft system. Then it'll go into the raft system and then come back in through this hole. So tomorrow, New Year's Day, we get to put the liner in. Well, it's a beautiful day on New Year's Day 2014. 50 some odd degrees, good day for sharks. We're going to try to get a liner in here. We're going to see how difficult it might be. We're going to use a little warm water to soften it up since it's not very warm out. See what we do. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The liner's in. Not in very well. We're going to use some warm water and uh, see so if we can start getting it settled in. Okay, we finally got the liner in. Uh, quite the task. Old, so the liner didn't really want to set in very good, but it looks like it's going to work really well. Okay, so we got the pump in, and uh, we'll fix and plug it in. We're filling up now. Everything seems to be holding. One by strip around the top to hold it all in, and uh, we'll give it a test run here real shortly.
the auto siphon worked, filled up the the top bed, came in, it started siphoning, and whatever reason, the first time we lucked up and it stopped like it was supposed to. Had to adjust the valve down some, a little bit too much water coming in. A um, little more adjustments, and uh, we'll go get some gravel for the top bed and start on the outside raft bed. Thank you.